What's going on, everyone? about DT here. Welcome back to Wolfstein 3D. Last time we wrapped up the uh, episode 3 Die View or Die by taking on Adolf Hitler and taking him out along with these decoys. Um, I have no idea what's wrong with Medicam. Like, um, I think I've mentioned this before, like something about like when I fire a machine gun or something, you'll hear like, boom, 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 boom. Uh, it's kind of like um, with Bombs A7 with the, his video of um, stealth when he had the incorrect files. It goes like, boom, 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 boom. sounds like it's hitting a frying pan or something. Yeah, I might have to check it out after this video. Um, I'm I haven't uploaded episode three yet. I've already done the first map as far as uploading it. I'll do a couple maps of episode 4 and I'll get along with um, uploading episode 3 and then I'll do the rest of episode 4 or I might just go ahead and do episode 4 and you know do, just uh well it's already the 4th no it's uh today, Monday, Tuesday. It's, today's the 14th it's uh, just about a bit after uh, 1 a.m. but yeah let's go ahead and jump in on I Am Death Incarnate This guard right here, take him out, and you'll usually take damage if you try that on either side. There's a guard on left and right, so yeah. Now we're gonna take care of these guards. Grab their ammo. And look, it's daytime. I thought it was nocturnal missions. Now, I like the outside part. You see, like, Adolf Hitler's faces, it's kinda. They're, like, blocked up by pillars. Like, no one wants to see your ugly face. Oh, you, you must be his twin. Oh my god, how many brothers you got? How many twins you got? <laughs> the Chandlers, I, I find it a good, you know, design with this map. You know, I like it. Now we're going to go here. Um, actually, we're going to go this way first. I'm going to go to right. Take this card out. Would you just come over here? Usually... There's no problem with them, but yeah, I mean, this time it happened, you know, there's a problem. Over there is nothing, now we're gonna, actually we'll take care of this area first. Kill that guard, grab the ammo. It will kill this guard. And now we're gonna go left, we'll kill this guard. And we'll kill the shoe stuff that's oh. inside. Damn, he, he took a lot of shots. Uh, grab his treasure, and now we're gonna go to the left again. Kill this officer, and kill this officer. I'll save that med pack for later. Now we'll kill this guard. Kill this guard. And then kill this one over here. And we'll grab the gold key. Which we're gonna need for later. Now we're gonna go back. And we're gonna deal... Uh, we're gonna deal with this area. There'll be several officers and shoe stop that come for you. So be prepared. It's not hard if you have the machine gun, but it can be a bit tricky if you have limited ammo. So I suggest doing what I did. Or go in that area and grab we'll deal with the shoe stop one there and then come back in here and take care of these enemies. There's gonna be some treasure, health and that well not ammo, but health. Found these tables and here's your first secret. I like this room too. You see the flags and such. You see these um, tables. If there was a judge right here. Be like, um, if it, we were in the United States, be like, do you pledge of allegiance? I pledge allegiance to poverty and such. Yeah, that, that happens in the United States of America. There's some ammo on your left and right is some help. Um, now we're gonna go back this way. We're gonna go left. And um, some health right here. Ammo and treasure in these alcoves or alcoves. Now we're gonna deal with the shoe stop. <laughs> Holy crap! Be careful. Yeah, I tried that before. It didn't really work out. We're gonna wait for the shoe stop. I thought these guys were alerted. That's why I was like, oh crap. Retreat. Which, yeah, in these little spaces is a chalice. So now we're gonna. I can use some ammo. Now we're gonna go back. And we're going to go over here. 
Yeah, we already dealt that area. Now we're gonna go left. Now we're gonna kill this. Would you just die? Man, these... Man, these enemies are like, nope, 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 I shoot you first. Like, I don't get it. Like, like I said, the rare stuff that can happen is going to happen to recording, guaranteed pretty much. Like, you can practice a hundred times, and each time there not be anything bad going on. But then all of a sudden, when you have to, re to do a recording, it's like, nope, screw you, buddy. Now, go beyond this area. Here's your second secret. Here's your second secret right here. And here's your third and final secret. There's going to be a chain gun in here. I'm trying to not get that ammo clip in case I need it later, but uh, okay. Here's some med packs in the second area. Now we got two more enemies to deal with. We got one left. I believe everyone's dead in this map, so now we're going to go to the exit. If you keep on going, you'll eventually get out of this area again. You'll get back to where we started from in this uh, part of the map. Both these doors take you to the same room. Here's the exit. Let's get out of here. For a starting map, considering uh, what we faced in the first three episodes, this is a pretty easy start off map. Um, now it can be tricky, like after you take care of the uh, guards in the first area, if you just open up one of the two doors in front of you with what limited ammo you got. Not necessarily the enemies will kill you, but the fact that you have limited ammo. That's what can trip you up. So if you go left, take care of that guard and grab the ammo in that area around the brown block. We'll go right and take care of the, uh, we'll first grab the ammo and treasure it in those alcoves and then take care of the shoe stop, which is a bit tricky as well. Um, then you should have no problem with that area, you know, that has the first secret with the big ugly on it, you know? And I really like the design of the first room, it's really nice, you know, I, the pillars and such, they go really nice with the gray walls, the gray stone walls, but just the gray stone walls itself, with nothing else, uh, that's... That makes for a very ugly layout, in my opinion. And that red area is not tricky, it's not hard at all. But what can trip you up is that uh, cobblestone area, when you get to the exit. And the two secrets can be a bit confusing to find. What I do is I get to the gold area, and facing that guard, you turn right, face that block, go around it, still staying on the block, and then you go to the wall on your right and press that and then you turn left from it, you go forward, you go around that block, well, only to the left of it, cling to that wall that you're facing, and then the one on the left, you press for a chain gun. And the second secret, of course, has the med packs. So yeah, um, yeah, it's not difficult for at all, but it picks up in floor two, for sure. So we'll move on to episode four, floor two, in the next video. Until next time, I'm out D18. Uh, peace out, everyone. By the way, I think this, um, map, uh, yeah, I'll get to it next video.